and it's cold out here today, but uh, we're putting the air system together for the dryer. Um, we just got the airlock put on and the clamps going for it. And now we're going to come over to the other end. We here and put the blower right there. I hope you can hear me. We'll see. It's kind of windy out. Um, we just moved our air filter in to a new location. Uh, it was out for an and it kept getting plugged up with a lot of stuff, so we moved it in closer this year. Hopefully the air suction from the dryer will help keep it clean. We'll see. Who knows? Maybe we'll end up changing it back to what it was. Everything's a learning process. So this is how you beat uh, bees wings plugging up your air filter. You remote mount it with a sock, kind of like that deal there. And then you uh, run it with a non-perforated tile line um, upwind to where your blower is so that it can always remain these wing free. Um, we were just on top of the grain bin. It's a nice typical fall day today, chilly, chilly on top of a really, really, really tall bin. Yeah, can't even see the top over there. But we we're getting the grain spinner out, spreader out. We're gonna change it. We don't like well dad doesn't like this big um see if you can see it hole here. Dad thinks it's still too wide, it's not spreading, it's just dumping debris down the middle like it shouldn't be. So we're gonna take that up to the shop and fix it the way we want it and it's gonna work perfect. Yay! This is how you measure things on the top of a grain bin when you don't have the right wrench. We'll get the right thing down. <gasps> and we fixed it, I think. Dad thinks. We believe. So what we're going to do, this shaft is going to pretend like that's the shaft that's supposed to go in there. We found these handy dandy things whoop, in our stockpile. Cut them to size. We're going to go up on the bin again, bolt them in, hopefully it, um, hopefully it works, we'll see, probably, probably will, like everything, it'll work, but we'll see. Alright, so it's my third time looking up these bend steps. Thankfully, I, it's not because we really forgot anything this time, once to get the green spinner spreader off wants to put the green spreader back on and now I'm taking up this little hose clamp thing or not hose clamp <laughs> oh dear lord if I can show it to you clamp we got some cables we want to put together so that's a little bit more secure safety security stuff crap this is a lot of stairs I'm like basically at the top, but I need a minute. Oh. Okay, that's two steps. All right. So the cable spreader is in that lid that we fixed. What I am up here to do to, right now is take these cables and cinch them in together so that if this top part ever came apart from the bottom part, because all it has is these two little clamps, if it ever came off, it doesn't shoot our grain way out in the middle of nowhere where it's not very effective. So we're just going to tighten that up a bit more, make sure it's really secure. Better. In case you were wondering what the view is like from the top of our bin, it's very, very pretty today. I don't know if you can hear me, it's awfully windy up here. I don't know how good my mic is, but it's, it's a beautiful, beautiful fall day. Hopefully we'll get to start combining some of this very soon. Just kidding. 
we're gonna have to make another trip. Drop the stupid nut, from the stupid clamp, down the stupid crane bin. <sighs> Just hope I can find it. I don't have to go back to the shop until Dad I dropped something else off the top of this green bed. It's just embarrassing. Ugh. Odin's Raven. I found it. The One Ring. It's mine, precious. All mine. So I actually found the stupid thing, as you might have heard. Never thought I would. Uh, just took one last look, found it, impressed with myself. Oh my god, I almost fell down the stairs. <laughs> oh, this is so safe. Farm safety 101, kids. Put that in your field day. Um, yeah, so we're gonna go up, not drop it down this time, put it up and be done. Finished that project, finally. I'm glad for it. If you guys didn't know, I'm not really fond of heights. So I'm glad that that project is done. I'm gonna go back in the shop. I think we're gonna put a uh, spring back on the end snoot. My dad has rigged it so that it, from the cab he can adjust it up and down when you go around terraces and around the edges. And we originally took the spring part out of the end of the snoot because we didn't think we needed it. We thought it was in the way, but he found another method of making it do what he wants. So we're gonna go back in there now, put the spring back in, cause it's supposed to be there and as long as we need it, we may as well have it. But uh, do that and then I'll head home, back to my day job at like three o'clock in the morning tomorrow. But at least we've got a pretty sunset tonight. Got something, right? Got something, better than nothing. Sorry, God. Just kidding. We're going back up. Gotta adjust something. Whoo! Okay. I deserve wine. I'm having wine tonight. I don't even care. I burned it. I burned my calories. I've done my steps. Oh, for the crap of the... What's happening? 